Hello and welcome to the OWC instructional series of videos. In this installment, we will be upgrading the memory in an early 2009 Mac Pro. While the Mac Pro used in many of these shots is a quad-core model, the steps for this procedure are nearly identical for the 8-core model. In instances where they differ, instructions for both the 8-core and the quad-core models will be shown. We have already shut down, unplugged, and placed our Mac Pro on a static-free surface. We are now ready to begin. First, we will need to open the side access door. To do this, lift the latch located on the rear of the Mac Pro until it locks in the open position. You may then tilt the door forward slightly and remove it. The memory is attached to the processor tray, which is located in this area. Remove the processor tray by opening the latches along the bottom of the tray, then pulling it straight forward out of the machine. On the quad-core model, there are four numbered memory slots, which are located in the front right area of the tray. In this example, we are going to install a pair of 2GB modules, so we will need to free up the first two slots. Push outward on the latches on each side of the memory module to eject it. Note that the memory slots have an off-center pin in them. This lines up with the off-center notch in the memory module. Firmly push each module into place. The latches should snap shut when the memory is fully seated. We now have a pair of 2GB modules, a single 1GB module, and one slot left open. Take one of the modules you just removed and place it in this last slot. On the 8-core model, there are 8 numbered memory slots which are located in the front right and rear left areas of the tray. Everything is going extremely well. In this example, we are going to install 4 2GB modules. To make things easier, we will first remove all the existing memory. Push outward on the latches on each side of a memory module to eject it. Note that the memory slots have an off-center pin in them. This lines up with the off-center notch in the memory module. Starting with the 2GB modules, install the memory in equal amounts on each side. Firmly push each module into place. The latches should snap shut when the memory is fully seated. We now have two pairs of 2GB modules, one pair on each side. Fill in the remaining slots with the 1GB modules you removed earlier. You may now put the processor tray back into the Mac Pro, making sure that it is fully seated. Before closing up your computer, connect your monitor, keyboard, and mouse and power up the Mac Pro. If the memory was installed incorrectly, a dialog box will come up telling you where the memory is currently installed and how it should be installed for best performance. The slot numbers in the dialog box correspond with the numbers next to the memory slots on the tray. Shut your computer down and rearrange the modules to match the order given in the dialog box, then restart to check it again. If you have installed your memory correctly, you will get a dialog box telling you that you have. You may then replace the door and latch it. 